guys, it's uh, Stefan from the Weekly Pen Review YouTube channel. Today I've got the uh, Bic Velocity 1.6 millimeter uh, ballpoint pen in blue for review. So basically uh, what I'm going to be talking about is the uh, price, the value, the construction quality of the pen, as well as uh, how it writes and it is uh, told to be Bic's smoothest pen that they've ever made. All right, so now we're just gonna do the uh, smoothness test of the Bic Velocity 1.6 millimeter ballpoint pen. And uh, we're just gonna start by writing out some phrases maybe, you know, just, um, yeah, what should I start with? Any? Def definitely a really nice, really nice uh, smoothness to it. Let's just do a little, um, maybe, oh, oh, that's good. Oh, baby. Oh, yeah. That's good, yeah. It's really, definitely a really smooth pen. I give it a uh, 4.5 out of 5 for smoothness, because, you know. So, uh, sorry for the background change, guys. Uh, had to switch rooms, you know. You know how it is uh, in high school. So, uh, I guess, like, the verdict is that I would definitely recommend this pen. It's got a sizable amount of ink in it from the uh, start. So, it's about $1.25 Canadian for this pen. Uh, like I mentioned before, just the clicking is exceptional. The smoothness is just above par. Well, you know, in a good way. And uh, the grips are quite nice. Definitely really durable pen, you know. Just, just throw it around anywhere, nothing's gonna happen to it. And uh, yeah, I would definitely give this pen a 4 out of 5. Some things that I would have liked to see from Bic, maybe in the next uh, run of these uh, Velocity pens, maybe, maybe a a little bit more of like a smoother click, you know, it feels a little bit grainy when I get to like this point, you know, you're really just like forcing it out. And um, also the pen tip, it's, it's kind of messy right out of the box, you know, I'm not really feeling the uh, sheer amount of ink on there. And uh, yeah, I mean, but it's definitely a good effort by Bic, definitely one of the better velocity pens I've seen, and uh, yeah, stay tuned for more reviews.